Well, there's this one story that I read up on. It's interesting. So I'm going to go ahead and make a video about it here. Two married couples. They both have kids, boys, outside of them two. Basically, they don't have kids together. They got kids elsewhere prior to them getting married together. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, James, to the O. A woman has a son by another man. The husband has a son by another woman. But they didn't meet up yet until later on after they had their kid. I guess their relationship didn't work. So they met, linked up, got together, got married. Now it's four people in the house. Husband and wife don't even have a child together. But they do have a kid prior to marriage, prior to meeting up. So the story goes like this. The woman is upset because her husband's son, which is her stepson, graduated middle school, eighth grade, graduated. We've been going a trip. She is saying, why you don't take your stepson along with your biological son, too? Because he's also an eighth grader. He graduated as well. So he was born the same year. And they graduated around the same time. Whether they went to the same school or not, I don't know. But all I know they both eighth graders. They both graduated the same summer. And she's upset because he'd rather take his biological child as opposed to stepson. So I said this. Let's back up some. Let's back all the way up before marriage. This is where accountability comes into play for you ladies. Did you know that he was like that with your child prior of a relationship, prior of marriage? If the answer is yes, and you decide to proceed anyway, that's on you. Any woman takes on a man, and that man isn't accepting her child or children prior to marriage, we I get married. It's going to be the same thing. That's a bad move on you, ladies. Straight up. Because he let you know. I spoke to one female. Same thing. First year of marriage. The man told you everything you needed to know. He don't care about your child. Before him. He told you this before y'all got married. And you still proceeded anyway. Now, years down the line, it's the same issue. You thought it was going to change? It ain't. Because one thing's for sure. If the man's not willing to accept another man's child while dealing with a woman, he's not going to do it during marriage either. He'll just be another kid out there that has a father elsewhere. He ain't going to take him in like that. Now, if you do have a man that will do it, then it's even better. And then the biological son and the stepson both go on a trip following their eighth grade graduation, heading in high school. That's why I have to backtrack all that. Like, did like was she aware of all this? If so, that's on her. If this came out of nowhere, then I can see why she's upset. But again, it's nothing like having your own. Because if, if it all boils down to it, if he has to choose who he's going to take custody of, of course he's going to take custody of his own child. Stepson going to get left behind. That is what it is. But yes, how you feel about that story? Was he right? Was he wrong? Let me know something. Comment down below. I'll be more happy to read your comments. Ooh, -wee. I'm taking my own son on a trip, but not my stepson. And they both graduated middle school together. Damn. Like, comment, share, subscribe to this video. Tell me what you think. Comment down below.